Alex Beer Reviews back again with another episode of As the Beer Swirls. I'm Dan. I'm Mike. Dan, what are we thankfully drinking today? I am thankful <laughs> and so thankful. <laughs> That's, I can't. All is well in the world. Yeah, all is great. Ah. Uh, so this is uh, from Brewery Arden out of Geneva, New York. And oh, this is right. their. Uh, I like the label. Oh, their labels are great. Yeah. They're freaking uh, So this is their summer ale, summer farm ale. Okay. Apologies. Uh, let me zoom in a little bit if I can. I bet you can. Just so people see the label a little bit more. Technology. Uh, cute little puppy dog on there. Uh, so this is their Belgian style saison diapachel. Yes. Uh, with spelt. I probably butchered that. But whatever As we do. Uh, yeah, farmhouse Belgian style saison de bacha. Um This golden farmhouse ale is traditionally released to celebrate summer. Spelt has a slight spicy flavor and is distinguished from wheat or barley by its nutty taste. Oh, okay. This aging ancient grain along with the unique yeast strain and warm fermentation creates an ale with mild warm fermentation, creates an ale with mild hot bitterness fruity aromas of bananas refreshing carbonation and dry finish don't you tell us what to do your um, inflection changed a lot during that reading yeah pretty much <laughs> I, I should I, I regret reading any of it um, 6.3 ABV canned on 6 oh my god 6 8 23 okay I know the date it's my birthday hey it is I was born in 2023 outstanding <laughs> I don't think you're allowed to watch our channel Probably not. God. Yeah, you're just doing it to piss me off. Do what? I'm seeing how it feels to be Sean from NerdSense and just not go the extra two seconds to flip the tab back down. I'm seeing how it feels to be Mike from NerdSense. Just and I gotta inner, say, an I see what he's doing. That I, uh, every day becomes harder and harder to keep it back. I gotta see. I know what he's doing. It's quite liberating. I'm like, why am I wasting so much time in my life to push it down? That's un, like that's energy that could be used elsewhere. Who does that that bit on SNL? I think it was David Spade who does the. You're wasting so much time saying the entire word, and he just starts saying half the words to make sense. That's what you're doing. It's crazy. We were just talking about Stuart from SNL. Okay. Stuart. That's uh. Look Matt, at me. That's Mad TV. Is it? Stuart. Yeah. Look at me. Um, that is a golden straw hazy. It's good. Goodness. It looks like a farmhouse ale. Oh man, it's so cloudy. I like it. Nice foamy. It looks beautiful. Right beautiful on a... this late September afternoon. Oh. Yeah, so time of filming, we're what? Three months out? Yeah, easily. Three and a half, four months. Okay. There's that, you always say horse blanket mm -hmm. for like yeah. farmhouse sales. A little bit of citrus in there. Like a, a lime citrus. If you smell the Belgian beer before. Yeah. <laughs> That's what it smells like. Uh, no, but it... Yeasty. Yeah. Bready. But it's white not, bready. It's very light and aromatic. Yeah. Yeah, very much so. A little, a little bit of floral note in there. Cheers. Mmm. Okay. I like that. It's got a nice little sweetness on that. Not drying. That's exactly what I was going to say. I prefer that over that, sweetness. over that Orville. Oh, yeah, okay. Belgian All right. layer. Yeah, because there is a really nice bright sweetness to it that just kind of makes everything mm. pop when you drink it. This is summer. Can you imagine this with, like, some nice spicy, like, shrimp kebabs or something? Oh, yeah. yeah. You know what I mean? This would cut right through it. Just uh, honestly, I think it would go well with, uh, they have uh, their Belgian frites. There, Ooh, the little seasoned French fries. Or I've whatever. not been there. I've oh, not been there yet. That brewery is fantastic. I, I, I really feel brewery. like I should go out there. Yeah, you're missing. Out. I mean, there's such a great chunk of breweries right there, but man, you could sit there all day. Yeah, it's great. Yeah. Mm. Very, yeah. just very, uh, just pungent. Yeah, but it is. It's very. It's floral. Um, it's outdoors. It smells like a bright sunny day. Mm -hmm. The orange peel. Yeah, I was going to say a little Spicy lemon zest. Feel. So what'd they say on the back we're supposed to get? I don't know. You read it in a bunch of weird tones. I couldn't pay attention. Hot bitterness, fruity aromas of bananas, refreshing mm -hmm. carbonation, and a dry finish. Yeah. It pairs well with fresh salads, aged cheeses, seafood, 
spicy shrimp, and grilled poultry. Okay. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> uh, it's yeah. Really and it's a little nutty taste, too. I think it's kind of part of the drying note on the back. It's it's like a fresh peanut. For me, it's not that drying, though. I get right on the back end. It's like just a bit of like peanut shell dryness mm -hmm. that oh. goes down. It's really good. It, and you know what else I love? You know, if you don't really, really like my reading, we can do the whole review over. That's yeah, an really. option. No, we don't. We, don't do that okay. we never start over. All right. Never. Damn, never. All right. Uh, Your literacy is there. just fine with me. What do you rate this? I'm going to give this a... That's <laughs> been the day today. I'll give it a four. Mm. Three. Three, eight. Okay. I think it's very solid. It is. Very drinkable, refreshing. Crisp, I feel like if clean. you like Belgian beers, this is your go-to summer. Is this like a a good entry-level Belgian beer? Oh, like it could be. Maybe you haven't had it before. Like, hey, try this. Oh, what yeah, do you yeah, think yeah. about yeah. this? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, definitely. Uh, if you're in the FLX region, uh, Seneca Lake area, there's some great breweries down there, and this is one of them. Brewery are dead. Yeah, I like it. Uh, yeah, I... I I think I got this at Wegmans. Mix of six. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. So. yeah, they usually have that in stock. Yeah, definitely. All right, gang. Uh, so until next time. You know, I still have a bottle of that Trapel, that anniversary Trapel. Oh, do you? In the fridge. Oh, wow. Okay. Down in the description, links, notes, comments, whatever. Thanks for watching, everybody. Cheers. Cheers.